I know the best my life, but the thing also brought me a few controversial issues. Yes, please, uh, you can read other political things. Senator, a senator may make a person. Our Senate should not, with the greatest dismay, the plan, the plan to increase electricity tariff by the relevant statutory authority in gross disregard of increased economic challenges with attendant widespread poverty and high cost of living. The Senate might note that the Honorable Minister of Power was reported was reported saying the nation must begin to move towards a cost-effective tariff model as the country is currently indebted to the tune of 1.3 trillion naira to generating companies uh, and 1.3 billion dollars old gas companies, according to him. Over 2 trillion needed for subsidy, only uh, 450 uh, billion was budgeted for in 2024. Uh, the Senate, my further note that the same electricity businesses are collecting money from customers for services not rendered. When they have not added anything to the equipment they inherited from PHCN, uh, communities buy transformers to replace damaged ones, in addition to overburdened bills and arbitrary estimates for metered customers. Cognizance, in a country where a greater number of population live below poverty level, with stagnant... With I think our concern for this moment should be how to generate electricity and effectively, adequately distribute electricity. Most of the problems that we are having today, especially in the manufacturing section, sector of the uh, economy, is as a result of low uh, power. And many organizations and companies are relocating from Nigeria simply because they don't have energy to drive their organizations. And so, Mr. President, I support this motion, and I want to say that this Senate should resolve again like uh, the Senate did in the, the Ninth Senate, that the desire to raise electricity should be put on hold until the distribution of electricity is adequate and proper. Mr. President, let me also say that this issue of subsidy remover has become in view of the prevailing situation in our dear country, we all do not need anybody to tell us what the situation in the country is all about. The populace are facing untold hardships and the situation in the country is anything but normal. And removal of any subsidy, not to talk of electricity subsidy, will be more than adding petrol to fire. The situation in the country do not allow for even a contemplation of that. So when I heard the Minister of Power talking about that removal, I don't know his, um, uh, why, but I believe that um, is ill-timed, is insensitive to say the least, and therefore there is the need for the Senate to rise to this occasion and intervene, let wisdom prevail 
and the governance of this country. We must manage the situation that we have at hand and make sure that as much as possible, we continue to give hope. I most importantly thank uh, our distinguished colleagues for their contributions and uh, opposition to the idea of increasing electricity tariff at this time uh, due to the current uh, uh, course of things across the country and the, and the sufferings of people. And Nigerians are very worried about the uh, following increases in, uh, in uh, products across the country and um, urge the Committee on Power to work closely with the Minister of Power to ensure that the resolutions of the Senate are respected in order to ameliorate and reduce any contemplated suffering on consumers of electricity in the country.